Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Thriving Thrifters. Clarissa here, and I have my director. Sean. It's a field mouse. Yes. If you're new here, welcome. We are a crazy dysfunctional family, and I like to do mystery box unboxings. I like to go to the Goodwill outlet, AKA the bins, here in the Austin, Texas area. Today, I'm doing something a little different. It's almost back to the early days of Thriving Thrifters before we even had a name two years ago. Um, I would get Goodwill Blue Boxes, the jewelry, repurposed, whatever it was. It's $19.99 and I went crazy. The jewelry? $19.99. They were $19.99. Now I think they're $29.99 think. Anyways, so as you all know, I'm doing a listing challenge. I piggybacked on Kelly Schaffner, 400 in February, and we're about halfway through and I, I challenged myself to just do 400 on Posh. I am a part-time reseller on eBay, Mercari, Poshmark, Depop. Depop is a new one that you haven't heard of, John. I've not heard of Depop. And I was looking at my listings that I've done on Posh, only on Posh, and I'm only at 174. So I need to list like a mad person. Mm -hmm. So I've actually had this for a very long time. Well, I don't know how very long it is. It is a Goodwill Blue Box Thrifty Apparel Box. I do not remember how much it is, so I hope there's a receipt in here. AKA I, trash. I'm not expecting very much out of this, but I list everything and I'm just part time, so I just need a. I mean, I want to return, obviously, ROI, but I mean, it's Goodwill, so I'm used to going to the bin, so maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised. We'd like to do a little something where we put it into the universe what we want. I think that this is. I think it's 10 clothing items, I think. I don't know. John? I'm going to say Lululemon will never be in here. Nike. That might be in here. These boxes go live on Fridays at 6 Eastern. And you used to, you had to be on the site right at six o'clock and they sold out at six oh 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 and 30 seconds yeah but now i've noticed the past several fridays that these have still been up and it tells you a little count on the bottom of how many boxes are left i do not know the backstory of these but this one came from lake worth florida mm. Over there, so hopefully everything in here is not a wrinkle. Along with all the other yes. thread up boxes that we have, plus new USPS shipping supplies. Oh, yeah. Don't cut your finger, please. That knife blade was awfully close to your fingers. All right. Are you excited, John? Um, I can't contain it. I'm so excited. <laughs> Oh, wow. That looks phenomenal. There's the receipt. This is the receipt. When did I order this? February 4th, $14.99. How many, how, did I say that? Oh, it was $19.99 total. Thrifty apparel, 10 items. Mm. There it is, there it there is. There you go. So two bucks an item, basically. This is interesting. I don't know what it is. I don't either. <laughs> mm, interesting. It says so, AF. So that's... Mother-in-law. You know what gets John really into this stuff is if he looks it up. Mm. Oh. Is this 8-Fit? Is that what it says? Yeah. Have you heard of it? No. I just was reading the tag. Is it like a muscle? What are these things on the... These are... This is interesting. I don't know what it is. I'm looking at it. 
I mean, it doesn't feel cheap. It's mm -hmm. got a million pockets. I'm not sure what all these pockets are for. There's the little, oh. there's the little logo. It's a fabric resistant band, so it's kind of like apparel that have resistance bands built into them. Oh, I was wondering why it was so big. Okay. That's what it is. So you wrap it around your legs oh. and you work out in your britches. There you yeah. go. So that's kind of what it looks like there. What are they selling for? Like well, these are just the resistance bands. So let me see if I can find the pearl. Here's a, um, this is probably a thing that tells us, yep, here it is, how to use. <laughs> well, there you go. This has a whole instruction book with it. Mm-hmm. How much are these new? I don't know. I can't find them. So they must not have been very popular. Well, here, scan this thing. Will that tell you? That's a user guide. Right or here. I, the that's a workout one. guide. It gets you to work out. Why are you not going away? Oops. That comes Eight nice. fitness clothing. Let's Little see candy. here. Size medium. That's interesting. There's that. Okay. I bet somebody bought this to somebody for a gift. And that gift got thrown away. Well, it taken the good way. Can I, I get $2 so for many, that? I don't know. There's so many, probably. I can't, there's so many things that have ape fitness in them that I can't find the right side. Oh, those are beautifully jeweled gloves. They're maroon. Mm hmm But they're jeweled. We are almost out of this season we've been out of in Texas. Well, it depends on what day it is. Bobby's Department Store, $3.99. Hmm. Okay. Almost famous. I have some of these jeans listed in my posh. This hmm. is cute. White with the little ruched size small. Quite scary. I don't see anything wrong with it. All right. That's okay. I'll list that. I can get at least $2 for that. Ann Taylor size large. Green. Cute. Mm -hmm. Very business casual. I do not see anything wrong with it. Easy to list. Yellow. Nice spring color. Polo by Ralph Lauren, size medium. All right. That's okay. Oh, wow. Polo. Oh, yeah. See yeah, anything nice. wrong with it. Nice. Everybody knows what the polo. I was looking for the Ape Fit website, but it looks like they're not in existence anymore. Oh, nothing wrong with that. This is a good spring colored box. I don't, I wouldn't have picked that up. I wouldn't have picked any of this up at the bins, but this was delivered straight to my door. Size small, Joseph and Lehman, Lyman. Just mm -hmm. a polo, blue and gray stripe. Mm -hmm. Cute. I don't know if I showed this. It looks like the eight fit thing didn't didn't take off, so they're maybe out of business. International line. It's a good looking shirt. Ingram. It's a good looking shirt. Red. Mm -hmm. Checkerty button mm -hmm. front. Yep. Nice. Let's see if it's what size was it? Size. Should be right there on the back tag, is it not? It's not. Hmm. 16 over 41. Okay. That's the neck size and then the chest size. <clears throat> I don't think it'll fit me. Oh. This new is a tag. stitch fix. New with tag. Nice. Beacon. Okay. This is cute. Mm -hmm. This is my style. You should wear it. Roll tab sleeves, blue. 
Oh, it says it's size small. It's called the Patty Roll Tab Knit Top. Hmm. All right. That's cute. Cute. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. Yeah. What is this? This is cute. Exposed zipper. Artisan New York. Or Artisan NY. Mm -hmm. And it's a dress. Yeah. It is. Blue, very springish. Size small. It does have a liner. Sleeveless. Very cute. I'm happy with this box. And what is this? This is a shirt. Style and Company. Style and Co. Extra large. Brown and black sleeveless. Mm -hmm. Cowl type neck or a scoop, but I'm not sure. Ruched on the sides. Very cute. It looks like a uh, it looks like a tomato bowl wall. Oh wait, just a blanket. Vertical design, size large. Mm -hmm. I think it's a cardigan. Just a black open front. Mm -hmm. Long sleeve cardigan. Mm -hmm. With a very big neck. Waterfall. Here's a pair of socks, H&M, $3.99. They have flamingos in snow boots. Maybe. Yeah, probably. Green. They are U.S. <coughs> size 10 to 11 and a half. Cool. Cute. Last two. I figured we were already at 10 items. Dress barn, size large. Okay. It's cute. Mm -hmm. Very business casual. Mm -hmm. Sleeveless. Yep. Cow neck. It's cute. I think it's brown. Mm, no, it's black and off white. Oh, it's got some metallic y. I don't know if you're going to be able to tell. I can see some sparkles in it. That's cute. Still looks black though under the light. But... Last item. I'm oh. surprised we didn't get Nike. Oh. Is it Nike? No. Oh, darn. Old Navy size large. Nice. Looks brand spanking new. Green. Yeah. Just a little sweat jacket with a hood. Yeah, a hoodie. Cool beans. Full zip. Yep, yep. Pockets. Cute. Yeah. I'm happy with this box. This will get me, let's see how many closer this will get me to my listing. Yeah. One. Two. Mm -hmm. Three. Mm -hmm. Four. Mm -hmm. Five. Mm -hmm. Six. Mm -hmm. Divided by 15, 130. Maybe. So a buck and a half. Yeah. You need to make per item to make your money back. Should be able to do that. I should I be doing that. I want to make more than my money back, but yeah. you got to make your money back before you make money. All right. So we are now at that part of the video for the quad question of the day. 
Would you rather be a genius that everybody thinks is an idiot or an idiot that everybody thinks is a genius? I would rather be a genius that everybody thinks is an idiot. Would you? Okay. I would rather be the opposite. I'd rather be an idiot that everybody thinks is a genius because perception is reality. Only if you care what other people think. Well, maybe if you were an idiot, you wouldn't. I don't. <laughs> I know you don't. It's a good thing. <laughs> oh, you're, you're not as thick-skinned as you like to think you are. All right. So, idiot that people think is a genius or genius that everybody thinks an idiot thinks is an idiot. Mm -hmm. All right. So, I hope that you will give this video a like. I hope that you will subscribe to the channel. If there's anything you see in this video that you like, that you love, <laughs> I forgot all about that. Check out my closets. They will be linked in the description. Or send us an email at... Well, they're going to be listed before this video through through at gmail.com, please. And we'll if see. the button is red, smash it, turn it gray, please. Ring the bell to get notified every day, new content. Every day. Thank you all. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.